What's going on, everybody? Welcome back. We are playing some post banning standard, and we're playing this interesting little brew. This was actually submitted, not submitted, but this was actually suggested by uh, Baron von Vaderham. You guys know Baron von, von Vaderham from the chat, and uh, it's basically a death touch list. We got four Falmire Knight, four Moss Viper, four Meyer Triton, four Hooded Blightfang. Four Chevelle, Cheville, Bane of Monsters, four Questing Beast, and uh, Hooded Blightfang is kind of like the glue holding it all together, where it's uh, whenever you attack with a Death Touch creature, you get to deal a point. They, lo they lose a life, you gain a life. And uh, you can also kill Planeswalkers whenever Death Touch creatures deal damage to them. Um, we also have Rabid Bite, four Rabid Bite to kill anything. And it's not fight, it's just literally deal damage. We also have two Lurus. Uh, which gets back any of these or any of these. We also have two Eliminate, two Heartless Act, two Fiend Artisan to search things out. And uh, if you have multiple of these, they do stack. So if you attack with a Death Touch creature and have two of these out, you're going to deal two damage. They're going to lose two life, and you're going to gain two life. Is Prowlmite better than... Uh... Oh, that was weird. It's plus X plus X, then it fights up to one creature. Well, I don't think this is. You think this is a bit, but Rabbit Bite doesn't fight. It just deals damage. So like, it, all our guys are one ones, <laughs> so they stay alive when you Rabbit Bite. But if you Primal Might, they're not gonna. They're just gonna die. So I, I think they're. I think they're just. I think Primal Might is a better card. But I think in the deck, Rabbit Bite's really what you want to be. Sideboard's Deadweight, Duress, Heroic Intervention, Return Nature, Elspeth's Nightmare, which I didn't even realize was a card. And that is that looks like a Phyrexian Negator up there, which is pretty pretty sweet. And then Murderous Rider. I mean, Ram Through is just the same thing, but with Trample, right? Target creature you control does damage, you go to power on target creature you don't control. If the creature you control is Trample... Excess damage is dealt to the control. Yeah, but like none of our creatures have trample. Oh, it is an instant though. Yeah, this is like strictly better, right? Yeah, we've already made we've already made an improvement. And how many lands is this? So 9, 18, 24. Okay. No dual face lands, interestingly enough. We'll see. We'll play it. We'll see if we need them. Pelucranos. Hmm. I mean, it doesn't have Death Touch. I don't know. You got Questing Beast. What do you want from me? I'm going to go back to Stream Raiders and place a dude, I think. I think I can do that. Oh, you can start early. Oh, wow, there's like 10 dudes in here. That's wild. I don't think I can place a guy yet. Um, Wow, three miles. So I'm going to ball you in the sand. I'm going to keep it because Temple, but I'm not going to... not going to love it. And we're also... On the draw. Wow, three Cheville Bane of Monsters. Seems good. Yep. Even that.
Wow, this deck seems this deck seems miserable. I'm like kind of flabbergasted actually. So they're just gonna kill this guy? And then attack for ten. Seems good. Unbelievable. Yep. This game, this deck is actually insane. What are we taking out? Fiend Artisan seems slow. Dead weight seems good. Instead of Return of Nature, I kind of like the other one that that kills an artifact enchantment or a flying creature. It's really weird having like a ninjutsu creature in standard. How do I place another unit? I can't figure it out. Uh, yep, yeah, let's keep this. Yep, I'll actually keep that. Not like it's gonna stay on top, they're probably just gonna mill me for two, but... Oh, they didn't. I don't actually have a bottom right corner arrow. Wow, Meyer Triton just seems to be helping them. That's actually hilarious. Well? Cool, but the joke plays the same. Are they countering this? Do they have a third Blood Chief's Thirst? This deck feels a lot like fairies, which is kind of weird. Yeah, keep that on top. <laughs> Actually, I mean, do we get to draw a card off of this? Probably not. They're probably just going to kill it with their fifth removal spell. Or not. Uh, 
<sighs> Fucking eye roll. Probably should have waited because they might have played Brazen Barber. But I wanted to try to see if we can hit a land, and if they didn't have draw on the lock, then maybe we can hit a land. Brazen Bar number two. I don't know what they're doing. I'm looking at their creatures. I feel like it's actually probably pretty decent other than against this rogue's deck specifically because they're like, they don't really give a shit about our death touch guys when they're all flying over. The problem with Chevelle is like you just have no real great way to Does I have death touch? Man, so much death touch. Yeah, the spiders are good. Oh man, we got 12 people up in here. That's pretty sweet. Dude, there's like a million of our units on here. I don't even know how they I don't even know how they win. How do you win this battle? Um and they got a brazen bar and they have a Nighthawk Scavenger in hand that we know about? Why didn't they play that? I don't know. Our deck does not have Nighthawks, but it really should, right? It's got Death Touch. Yeah, we're going to make some changes after this for sure. played this guy yet? I mean, I think you're just Brazen Borrower into Brazen Borrower. Petty Theft into Brazen Borrower, I guess, is the uh, better way to, to say that. But, I, I mean, I probably would have just played this guy because he's significantly better and then Brazen Borrower. Yep, there's the Brazen Borrower. And... There's the brazen bar. I'm pretty sure they're just gonna kill our Myers right and then. Oh no. Hmm. Yeah, I actually don't like eliminate, and I think eliminate is a is a is a. If you uh, 
Interesting. I mean, we're dead, right? But... Why not? I mean, if we kill this guy, these two kill us anyway, so we kind of... Sure. Fucking amazing. I've never... I've. Uh, this is like the, uh... This <laughs> the story of never didn't have it. McGee over here. Okay. So we're making some changes. I think Eliminate is actually a misplay in this format. Okay, so we're definitely making some changes to this. Death Touch deck. Uh, Death Touch. I assume every creature's... I don't actually like Meyer Triton here because milling yourself seems actually pretty bad. Um, let's... Bring in four of this sweet... Sweet son of a bitch. Take out the Meyer Tritons. I think Eliminate's bad. Um, I think the number of creatures that have counters on them is significantly lower uh, than the limitation of... of, like, only being able to kill a 3 power. Plus, you're never... Like, I, I say this every time, but you're never killing 3 mana Planeswalkers, so it's literally just smother. When Heartless Act kills almost any creature you can think of. Like, so when you're faced with, like, Zar Zareth, is that his name? The The... The ninjutsu guy or if you're faced like questing beast you just can't do anything about them okay so Interesting. We also have Tajiro Blightblade, which is an elf rogue, which I kind of like better. Does that is that better for us? I definitely agree with the escape spider. I also kind of like Grim Dancer, but I don't think we want another. Uh... I don't think we want another. The word, the word I'm going for here is... I'm tired. Um, fuck, I have no idea what I was going to say. I'm going to take out the Eliminates. I'm going to take out one Cheville because he's legendary. I'm going to add another Heartless Act. Can someone tell me what I was about to say? I literally forgot. I fuck, I totally blanked. Are you guys placing your units? Oh yeah, you are. This is actually pretty sweet. Just because it's like, it's just a nice thing you can have up in your browser and you can just like, let the battles do the work. Sorry, I was getting a Pop-Tart. Unbelievable. Um, why no Grim Dancer? That's what I was talking about. I just don't want any more three drops. Like, we already have ten three drops. I think Grim Dancer is fine, but I think, like, Nighthawk Scavenger is just kind of like a better Grim Dancer. Because instead of, like, instead of Menacea's Flight, and instead of death touch and lifelink he has like he has basically all three of these he has an evasive ability death touch and lifelink oh what up sacred onk morning my dude uh i don't think we're ever going to do this for seven okay so i was going to put in Two murderous riders. Actually, where, what happened to our sideboard? Where do we have three murderous riders here? Well, 
Why is white highlighted? Oh, because of Luris? Sure. Okay, this is where we wanted to go. Uh, return any of battlefield creatures that have a different cover to mana cost X or less. So for three, this is actually pretty good, right? Sacred Dank? I mean, I think you have to know what an Ankh is, right? <laughs> Which is weird because there's plenty of Ankhs in Magic, so it feels like... I think Awakening seems pretty good, especially over, like, two swamps. And I have no idea why that's just not in here. Um... Also, Hagra Mulling is just fine. And I'm kind of Turkish fights. I have seven. You put a creature card for my own battlefield. This one makes three slots. Just four for making your chairs. That's okay. I mean, I feel like you just. There's no reason not to play one of these, right? Fight land is all right, but again, like I don't really want to be fighting. Tangled Florahedron. Um, so this is 60. We have 7, 8, 9, 15, 16, 17, 18, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26. 26 cards that can be used as mana. <sighs> Elspeth's Nightmare just seems kind of cute. And also... Return to Nature seems worse than the other one. I forgot what it's called, though. Destroy flying. Broken Wings. Yeah. Well, I mean, you can just play Broken Wings instead, which I think is just better. Because I think killing a flying creature is significantly better than killing a, uh, than exiling one card. Yeah, I'm just going to put four in. I'm going to take out the Murderous Rider because we do have, uh, another Heartless Act and two Hagras. I might actually just want another Hagra Mauling. I don't, I don't think I like Fabled Passage, to be honest. I really wish Wood uh, Woodland Cemetery was legal in the format. There's no other dual lands, right? I mean, it's funny because this is 20 lands, but then we have uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So it's, kinda, it's still kind of like 26 lands. All right. Um... These are significant changes. But I think it's probably fine. But this is also what? 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 13 black sources. And 6, 7 green. I think I just want to add one more forest. Okay. 
Let's try it like this. How's our Stream Raiders battle looking? Oh man. There's like a million dudes on this on this map. Um, okay, so we have a Hagra mauling, and that's it. I will mulligan. I will keep this. And... Get rid of Turn Timber, I think. Because right now this lets us cast both of these. We can cast Nighthawk. I'm just going to run this out first. I don't want to assume we're going to hit a fourth land here. Oh, Maze Mind Tome. Hooded Blightfang next turn is pretty decent. We have 25 units to their six, yeah. For those who don't know what we're talking about, we're playing a game... Uh, in between rounds called Stream Raiders. We're just gonna pass and, and draw a card of Falmire Knight here. I, I mean, like, they have three mana up, and I, I have to assume that there's a counter spell. Do you think you're going to play some more standard after the bans? Um, this is... What do you mean? This is standard right now. Oh, it did say historic, but... Yeah, I mean... And now we're playing standard. Oh yeah. You got third counter spell? No. Doubt it. <laughs> Jesus. Oh good lord. That seems like a good trade for us. Am I missing something? I mean, nothing we play is going to get resolved, so this is kind of frustrating, but... Yep. To the surprise of no one. I think Maze Mind Tome is very, very good. What are you gonna do now? Nothing. Look at this, they got Shark Typhoon, Voracious Great Shark, and the Voracious Great Shark sleeves.
It's a moss viper. You gonna counter my one one? Oh wow. You got a negate for this? So you get a 4-4 four, four and a 2-2? Two, two? It's pretty good. No. Okay. Seems good. Is this just main phase? No, this has to be EOT, right? Yeah, wow, that's real good. Shark Typhoon is one of many cards that makes me like, really, why, why would you make this? Questing Beast is another. Where's our, like, this is ridiculous. I guess we could have played this as a land, but like, but why? Why should I have to do that? I mean, this is just... Uh, we're not going to beat this. Like, this is just too much card advantage. We have nothing going on. Okay, let's take out... Two Hagra Maulings. One of you. Bring in three Duress. So it's rough to take out the Hagger Maulings because you're kind of taking out lands, right? So right now we have 7, 12, 14, 18, 19, 20, 20, 20 23 lands, which should be fine when our top end is... Uh, Yeah, like we can definitely take out a couple of Ramthers for Broken Wings because they do have artifacts and enchantments. Sixty cards. So you take out three, add three. Just add one Hagra mauling back for the land. Something funny just uh Oh boy. Um Yeah, I'll keep this seven. We're on the draw, so we can actually go Chevelle on Cheville Cheville on turn two. And that should resolve. Oh gem razor does seem good. I agree. Blighty, blighty boy. A land would be nice, because then we get to go uh, duress them, see what they have, and then play Blight Fang. Uh, 
two rewinds and an essence scatter. Well, let's take the essence scatter. And let's play Blightfang because you can't do anything about that. So now we know they have all the things. Hmm. I mean, they can't do anything about this, right? They can play a 2-2 shark, which does nothing. this guy sure you got it hmm. thank you Oh, Big Black Dick, thank you for the resub, buddy. Welcome back. Really appreciate it. I mean, they can just take four a turn if they want. If they want to play a big, fat, voracious great shark, that's also totally fine. For no value. end of turn I'm not going to play anything into rewind voracious great shark they might just slam a voracious great shark or make a 3-3 three, three. What is this? I don't know what this is. I have no idea what that means. Oh yeah. Give me that trade. Give me a land. One time. Not a land. Okay. I guess we're just gonna have to throw dudes out here. Sure. Interesting. Why wouldn't you just counter it with this? <laughs> okay, well, sure. What are the odds they have more counter spells, guys? It's a hundred percent. Yep. Seems good. The block. Hmm. 
You got it. Interesting. I have two cards, right? So it's really frustrating. Is that four rewinds? Nope, only three. Okie dokie. mana. If we hit a land, we can play two things. Just not that land. Actually, still lets us play two things. Guys, our stream raiders battle starts in two minutes. Are you guys ready? It's 62 to 8. We might have a shot. Yeah, I think we're looking good. Uh, I'm just going to start it early. Sure. <laughs> Two counter spells. You got it. Nothing's happening in magic, we're just getting attacked. We drew a castle. And now I just want to watch these guys get massacred. Doesn't even seem close. Jesus. <laughs> this is not even close, man. should do it. Alright. Uh, play the land. Let's play... Let's play Nighthawk. Don't have Voracious Great Shark. Okay. Okay. Oh, they're digging. split grant them rewards back to the map I did I collected my prize right that's what you're referring to right one two three four five we have seven mana so we can go one two four five six seven
Very good, very good. Yeah, that's a 10 10. That's a Rin 10 10. You know, like the the dog. <laughs> oh. Interesting. So, one, two, three, four, six, seven, but only three green. I think that's fine. We don't have to play Moss Viper this turn. Cancel that. Good combat. Thank you. I mean, if they want to triple block this guy, it's totally fine. We have Alaris on board. Dalkery, thank you so much for the reset, buddy. Welcome back. Sure. Oh, just a hard cast shark typhoon with three mana left. That's eh, pretty bad. Not for us, mind you. I mean, we can attack with both because they have to block here. This, so that's pretty cool. Sure, resolve that. Good combat. I have no cards in hand. That's pretty sweet. Yeah, this just seems insane. I mean, they get to draw two, but I mean, we're way ahead. <laughs> Sure. You got it. Um Can you just block already? Oh yeah, draw a card. I like it. Okay. 
Are they double blocking the voracious the fiend artisan? Because I can just cast that guy again. Oh, there's chumping it. Fascinating. Uh, let's get rid of the anti-cognition because we can. Yeah, they're just dead, right? <laughs> Personally, I am very pro cognition. I mean, they still have Shark Typhoon and they have double Maze Mind Tome. This game is far from over, but. This has been a pretty obnoxious match. Um, yeah, we'll put on the 1-1. One, one. I feel like that guy has the best chance of, uh, dying. Wow. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. That seems bananas. All the guys having death touch is pretty good, too. I'm not gonna do the math here, I'm just gonna, yeah, because, like, if they have this, like, they just get a free, a free guy. And, like, I just don't feel like having the Lurus blocked by the Voracious Gray Shark because it's just too much of a of an advantage. Sure. I mean, now we can at least turn Timber Symbiosis, which is kind of cool. card heartless act and we can play hmm, one two three four five six seven i feel like it's just better to play this this turn uh <laughs> that's pretty cool this deck is Decent as a control deck for sure. I mean, how many things can they play here? They we know they have this. They can play this like three times. Make three three threes. And kill one of them. One, two, three, four, six, seven, eight, nine. Yeah, we're just gonna attack with this guy, this guy, this guy. We can also start activating Fiend Artisan to get uh, the last questing beast out of the deck. One, two, three. It's like we can sack like Falmire Knight. Oh, these guys are two twos. No, they're th yeah, they're two twos. Oh wow, the escape cost is three, but they're not three threes. We have 32 life here. I mean, we'll just play this guy because they have to counter it. So they just. They do make a 4 4 here, though, but it's a free card. Oh, 
Oh, this deck is really obnoxious. Yeah, we still have the, the three mana lord. We have 18 minutes, they have 11, so that's cool. Yeah, but the thing is, I like playing the pet decks. Like, that's what I actually enjoy in Magic. I enjoy seeing what people come up with, and I enjoy playing them myself. Like, I don't actually think it's super fun to play against, like, tier one deck after tier one deck, so... I don't know. I don't, I don't, I don't think this is... I think if this is a bug, I think if this is a feature. Um... What does fair shout mean? I've never heard that. I mean, just because I like playing against uh, pet decks doesn't mean I like playing against every single pet deck. I mean, I don't think those. I don't think my statements contradict one another. They have 15 cards in the library? Sure. Sure. This is wild. So they're tapped out now. Got it. Sure. Fine by me. One, two, three, four. This versus one, two, three, four. Hmm. So, uh, one, two, three. Okay, it's fine. Sack the mossy boy. Well, we are at 44. And this deck feels like it never runs out of steam, which is interesting. It's a 15-15. It's pretty sizable. Alright. Well. I mean, I actually genuinely don't know how many counter spells they could have left on their deck.
How many cards are left in the library? 14 cards left in their library. Listen, trail page twice X. I guess I don't have that. Two 13 13s. Solid. So we need five for Questing Beast, and I guess one for Falmire Knight. Do we die? 26, 246, 10, 36. No, I guess we don't die, and they probably chump block with one of these guys. By chump, I mean. We could get a second, uh... Oh, let's get rid of that. Oh, they just took it. Okay. Well. I mean, this is a two-turn clock. Well, that's pretty wild. Um... cards in hand. I think we're actually dead, which is kind of shocking to me that I wasted this much of my life. Sure. Don't care. Um... One, two, three... Four... One, two, three, four. We still have one, two, three, four, five left after that. Why don't any of these have trample? That's the question. Oh, that might be the game. <laughs> wow. Questing Beast coming through in, in, the, in a clutch. Wow. <sighs> Good grief, man. Good grief. We also had three copies of Broken Wings in the deck. Couldn't find one of them. Jeez. Actually, gonna take out some moss vipers for like the chain web. That guy just seems good, right? God, if we end up winning this, it's gonna be amazing.
Ooh. Don't like. Okay. Oh, I'm gonna ship. Actually, we'll ship a Heartless Act. Hmm. Might as well get a Moss Viper out there. Yeah, they have to win this game in seven minutes, which seems not ideal. Oh, that's a nice hit. Missing a two drop is not great, but we have field passage anyway, so like I don't want to play this as a as a land. So it kinda of works out. We can also broken wings this thing. Bubble snare. On a one one. You know what? It's a bold strategy, Cotton. Let's see if it pays off for him. Oh, I do like that. I think we're going to pass and just kill this when they draw a card. Classic Paula Dean's Awakening. You know how she do. Wild. Yep. I guess we could play this as a land. I'm being greedy. I mean, we know they're going to have Voracious High, Voracious Gray Shark as one of their two cards. Oh, that's actually significantly better. I'm a little afraid of Great Shark here. I think we're going to pass for a turn. But then they get to draw a card. You know what? I'm going to make them have it. I'm going to make them look for it. <laughs> Interesting. They put a card on top, but then they drew a card as well. Whoa! Fascinating. Seven mana. Are they going to steal my questing beast? Shark Typhoon. Oh, see, that's nice. You got it. Randomly scry. Off the tippity top. You're right. You're right. Nailed it.
Four minutes and 43 seconds and they have to win this game. None of these cards are going to do that. I'm definitely tempted to draw a card during our upkeep. Questing beast doing doing what a questing beast does. Sure. So I I think we want another green here. Okay. It's gonna be a land we're gonna put on the bottom. Hagra mauling? Eh, it's kind of land. Eh, one, two, three, four, five. I'm just gonna pass here. Draw a card if they don't do anything. They have nine mana. Look at the top six cards. That's a good dig through time. Bubble snare. Okie dokie. about scavenger how you feel about that guy they have three minutes to win this game I don't understand sure oh wait they didn't counter that they drew the cards was that a mistake I don't know how to feel about that that seems not correct They're gonna bubble snare this guy. Wow, so many bubble snares. Solid one one. They're tapped out. Well, that's kind of cool. One, two, three, four, five, four. Okay, cool. I'll resolve it. They have two minutes and 28 seconds. I mean, I guess it's possible if they play like some big fat idiots. But now we're gaining life, so. Oh, wow, that was a really good hit. Yeah. 
I feel like we, uh, after a hard fought battle, we're definitely coming close to the finish line here. They go to three just from these guys alone. Yep. We have double heartless act. Make my way downtown. Sure. I don't actually care about two twos. Three threes are my my big concern. Sure, just two chumps. And we get to draw another card? Good grief. You got it. It's interesting that they didn't... Hmm. One, two, three, four, five... And I'm sure they have, like, a voracious great chart here. Rewind? Sure. You got it. Yeah, that seems fine. We get to keep up Heartless Act number dose. I grew a full beard over the course of this match. Buddy, you and me both. Three cards. They have a minute on the clock. Okay, so basically we're going to win through time. Please never play this deck again against anyone in the history of life. So all I have to do is swing and they're dead. Okay, sounds good. Let's do that. Oh my god, why are we doing this? No, I guess you're not dead. Okay. Oh boy. And I don't want to Heartless Act because they have three cards and I'm sure they could do some shenanigans. They only have two cards in their graveyard though, so they can't actually glimpse anymore. What is this? For how much? Five? I guess I hope you don't have another counter spell in hand. <laughs> Never fails. Okie dokie. Seven, seven, oh, they're just... What? Oh, they just lost because of time. Jesus, God. Oh, dear my God. Oh, my God. That was... The worst thing that's ever happened. I'm going to play one more match with this deck. Burke Leo. Oh my god, dude. Never play that deck again. <laughs> 
Jesus. <laughs> oh man, it's just like uh, <laughs> good games for sure, but my God, man. I am dead inside. I am dead inside. Um, sand's not great. I'll keep it. I'll keep it because a green source is pretty decent. so good at this game. <laughs> Why do this to yourself and play it back? Berkeley, oh, good games and uh, good luck, buddy. Oh, it's a glass casket. A glasket, if you will. Well, look at this. Look at the way this moves. Oh, wow. Look at it. Look, now the land's on the other side. Now it's on this side. Now it's on that side. What? Yeah, we're just going to play this as a... Let's just play this Hooded Blight Fang. I was going to play... I was going to draw a card with Falmire Knight, but having this guy out and Questing Beast next turn is pretty great. Look at it dance in the breeze. I know, it's beautiful, right? It's beautiful. Oh, main phase omen? Is that correct? Buddy, that card has flash. You ever heard about flash? Let me tell you. Let me tell you a little something about flash. That's a seven damage, bro. Are they going to shatter? I get to draw a card if they shatter. Here it comes. Archon. Buddy. Ugh. Ugh. Too bad you don't have trample. Feeling good. Are they dead? Oh, another one. Another beautiful pony. Stay gold, pony boy. <laughs> yeah. Why doesn't it have trample? How stupid. Oh, Luris? Hmm. That's the thing, I guess. They take two automatically. They have to block here. So we play Luris and Chevelle. Oh, Chevelle's under here. Chevelle. <laughs> That's funny. Man, just chumping Questing Beast forever seems bad. play land might as well play a Falmire Knight if we played Swamp instead we could have drawn a card but well that's that's better with an Archon of Sun's Grace
Um, Broken Wings seems great. Done with streamers. We could do one more. I'll do it right now. <laughs> I liked his song. That's kind of funny because, you know, it's a... That's a band. I think we probably take Moss Viper out for, like, duress. I feel like there's no way Moss Viper is correct, even if we're capitalizing on Death Touch. Alright, my dudes. Let's... Let's go to this level 3. Oh, I can't do level 3 yet. Oh, I have to do... Yes, I can. I can just do this one. Um, We're going to mulligan our hand. I'm still going to tank it up. I don't see any reason not to. All right, guys. Do do what you got to do. Uh, Mulliganos, the god of mulligans. Yep, there's a keeper. Hmm. Let's get rid of ramp through. We already have two removal spells. Broken wings should take care of the other things. And temple will hopefully find us a third land. Return to Magic Fest? God, I don't even know. I mean, there's a lot of factors. And learn to fly again. You guys know that uh, Broken Wings is sung by a, a band called Johnny Hates Jazz, <laughs> which has always struck me as hilarious. Hey, who sings that Broken Wings song? Oh, Johnny Hates Jazz. Weird. Yeah, I know. Learn to live so free. And when we hear the Michael Bees. Right there. Yeah, there you go. That's a little better. A little better. I mean, what are they? Do you think that counter spells in this deck? I don't know. Is it not Mr. Mister? I don't think so. It is Mr. Mister. Who's Johnny Hates Jazz? Fuck, you're right. What's the Johnny Hates Jazz hits? Shattered Dreams. That's what I'm thinking of. I'm thinking, I got Broken Wings and Shattered Dreams. I, got, I just got them confused. Hmm. Well, that is unfortunate. They are basically the same thing, yeah. Wish I had a land. Okay, well... It's your boy. You got Jwari. No, you're just gonna cycle. Sounds good. And by cycle, I mean scry. Ding, ding. The 80s was full of fantastic one-hit wonders. We're here for you, though. Don't, don't ever forget that. Who cares? I appreciate you, buddy. What does this do? Remember a land, if, it, if they play another land in the battlefield, they return a land they control, sure. Actually, that could be good. If we play Fable Passage, we can just bounce our... Are these things? Hmm. 
Well, that's pretty decent. So we got four. This guy's a 2-2. Two, two. We can actually play this ram through, get a 4-4. Four, four. I kind of like that. that illusion. Dead weight. Glass casket. <laughs> well, there's a lot of things you're doing. Two cards and oh, they put Yorion in their hand. Okay, well we could definitely use more uh, things, more black mana. So what do they blink this to draw a card? They blink this to get rid of Nighthawk. It's pretty rough. Another glass casket and a dead weight. Safety dances by men without hats. Is that correct? Men at work? Is it men at work? Men without hats. I was right the first time. Damn. Seems good. Um. See, it's weird to me that there are, there is men at work and men without hats. Both of those, both of those '80s bands exist. See, that's weird to me. Okay, Yorion. Actually, this is good because now we know they don't have. I guess they still have glass casket, but if we draw land, land's actually fine, I think. We know they have glass casket. We play this guy, they glass casket, and they kill us. So, I think our goal is to just, I think we just gotta kill Yorion here. And then if we draw another black, we can play keep up. We can play Nighthawk and keep up Heartless Act. I'm just gonna do it now because we know they have um, the pay one counter spell. So unfortunately, Man Overcome that has is a crossover, and we can never pull off. What? If, what? But what? But to dream, you know? They're just gonna scry to? Sure, that's fine. So we take four if we don't... <sighs> I think we're just a little too far behind here. Also, not hitting lands for like 17 turns is pretty bad. Because like if we play Nighthawk Scavenger, they just glass casket it and kill us for four. So we can just take care of creatures one at a time. Again, if we draw land, we can go Scavenger, Ram through, kill this guy. And then if they play Glass Casket on it, we can Broken Wings it. Men working without hats is my Huey Lewis in the news cover band. Yeah, that makes sense. We're at two. Ugh. Well, that's the end, because we could not hit a land. <laughs> three three drops and a ram through. Uh, Jesus. 
die to this one doomed this doom foretold token Got one ram through for another duress. A lot of removal. <laughs> we also do a damn fine lower voice set. Wow. Well, you know what they say. I, I don't. I don't know what they say. So I'm gonna play first. Man, I'm working for this weekend. Oh, uh, working for. It. No, that's different. That's a different song. That's working for a living. Taking what you're giving because you're working for a living. Um, I'll keep that. This is another battle where I feel like we're ready to go. After this match, I'll we'll battle. In stream raiders, my dudes. It is stream raiders, my dudes. One, two, three. Falmire Knight or this guy. We can play this. Eh, we're just going to play this guy here. I actually I love these modal dual face lands so much. Like they're so good. Talk about fundamentally changing the game of magic. Oh, that was a freaking great draw. Also, Hagra Mullen gets to knock this dude out. Oh boy. No, don't like that. All right. You have got me. Um, yeah, I'll keep that guy. That guy seems fine. We have five mana. I'm going to pass. They either sack Doom Foretold or the Apparition, so... Got it. And we're gonna broken wings this thing if they uh bing bing ba ding bing. No value for you, buddy. You got it. We're probably gonna draw a failed passage off the top. Oh, we know it's Falmire Knight, actually. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, that's a pretty sweet draw. I think we actually just play Hagra Mauling as a as a as a land here, so we can turn. Turn Tim turn timber symbiosis. They have four cards though. Is this any player? It's on our opponent's control, okay. Cast him as a land. <laughs> That's solid. Oh my god, this, these guys are real annoying. They're very good. I enjoy them. Affinity, what's up, my dude? Actually, I knew you were here because you were in the Stream Raiders, but like... It's so funny because you never say anything other than clips. And it's like just our unspoken communication method. You know what? I'm gonna talk in clips.
actually, let's 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 cycle this guy now. We don't have anything else to do, and if we hit a land, then we can play it. I think robots are cool. <laughs> I don't really have anything to contribute. I just think robots are cool. Are you gonna blink this guy and give me a two-two? I mean, this is wild. Sure. Oh shit! Treacherous B. Whenever you go back to Magic Fest, hit me up at the Dex Protection booth and I'll... Oh, sweet, dude. Berkeleo, man. Really appreciate the uh, the gesture. I feel like we just played this. And hope we hit Questing Beast, right? We did not, but Nighthawk Scavenger seems pretty beast here as an 8-6. I guess they could always play Yor... No, they can't. They can't play Yorion yet because it's not in the hand. Berkeleo, what's your name? What's your actual, what's your non Berkeleo name? I roll. This deck seems sweet. Just because it's playing a bunch of good cards. I mean, I guess when you're playing like 80 cards, though, you get to play all the good shit. So, Charles? Alright, I'll keep that in mind. Whenever, whenever real life magic events ever one two three one two whenever whenever they happen again. Look at all these things. You should have killed him when you had the chance, Charles. It's true. Blink Birth, Blink Elspeth, Blink Skyclave, Blink Charming Prince, Blink Omen. This is amazing. What an what an explosive turn that was. I think I'm pooping my pants now. I feel like we rest. I feel like we're still in really good shape here. Just kidding. Swim in the filth. What is this? I don't even remember this clip actually. You're disgusting. You pig. Oh god, dude, that was so bad. <laughs> Booyah! It's because <laughs> you're default like looking at me. So like as oh Jesus. Yeah, swim in the filth. Swim in the <laughs> filth! Good lord. And then you ready for those chickens? <laughs> <laughs> don't say it weird like that. What? Are you ready for those chickens? I don't even know what's going on in that clip other than Michael's burping and it smells real bad. Well, I guess we can draw a card here, which is kind of okay. Where did Yorion go? Why didn't they blink this too? Because then it would go to the graveyard. Burke Leo, have a good night, buddy. It is only 2.48 here, so... Nope, don't do that. Do this. Oh dear Jesus. Yep. 
That's a no bueno. Is our battle up yet? Oh, we got 11 minutes left. Jesus, this is brutal. This is not sustainable. Oh, big man mountain time. <laughs> Got him. Oh, dear Jesus. Is this a loop? Is Charming Frenzy or on a loop? Oh god, why are like all these decks are so miserable? <laughs> I don't understand. How many cards do they have left? Can they mill themselves? No, they have 44 cards left. Okay. Oh, it only loops once a turn. Well, thank goodness. Is that all? They only get to draw an extra seven cards every once a turn. I was like, why did you choose that one? And I was like, oh, wait. Never mind. This guy. You counter this guy? This guy. This guy. What are you getting against all this? Nothing. I'm pretty sure we're going to concede now. Kills Batman. No text. Yep. I'm gonna just concede. I, I don't feel like it's worth my time. Thank you guys for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed this Death Touch deck. Submitted, not submitted really, but... You know, presented to me by uh, Baron Von Vaderham. I thought it was actually pretty sweet, and uh, I like the changes we made. However, I don't know if, I don't know if it's grindy enough to really compete in this current standard format. I don't know. Either way, it's a fun option. You guys can give it a try, and uh, yeah, let me know what you think. Let me know what you what you're feeling, and uh, yeah. Slam those like and subscribe button. Check out manatraders.com. You can get twenty percent, fifteen percent off the first three months of any subscription, along with the link and promo code down below. Uh, you can also get 68% off in a free month at uh, nordvpn.org slash franklapore. If you guys want to sign up for a sweet internet security solution, uh, NordVPN is a great one. And it's a great way to support the channel. So check that out. Be sure to like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching, guys.